Let's see how to solve the algebraic equation. To eliminate the denominator, let's do cross multiplying. So we get two times x squared plus one squared equals nine times x, and then times x plus one squared. Let's expand it. So we get x squared plus one and then plus two x. At this point, you can expand both sides, but you will get an equation of degree four, which might be difficult to solve. Let's do a substitution to reduce the degree. So we we'll let x squared plus one equals t, here equals t. So let's see. So t equals x squared plus one. Then the equation becomes two t squared equals 9x times t plus 2x. We can view this equation as a quadratic equation in terms of t. So we get 2t squared and then 9x times t, 9xt, move to the left side. So we get minus 9xt, 9x, 2x, 18x squared and then minus 18x squared equals zero. To factor the left side, we need to break the middle term. The rule is we need to find two numbers, p, q, such that p plus q equals negative nine. p times q equals the product of two and negative 18, which is 36. The two numbers are negative 12 and three. So you can see that we go negative 12 and 3. The sum you go negative 9, right? So then we break the middle term as 2t squared minus 12xt plus 3xt minus 18x squared equals 0. Now take the common factor of first two terms, t, 2t. So 2t, so get t minus 6x. For the second two terms, the common factor is 3x. So we get t minus 6x. Okay. So take the new common factor out. So t minus 6x times 2t plus 3x equals 0. So we have two possibilities. One is t minus 6x equals 0 or 2t plus 3x equals 0. For the first one, get back to x. t equals x squared plus 1. So we write x squared, write this term first, minus 6x and then plus 1 equals 0. It seems hard to factor, so let's directly use quadratic formula. So we get x equals negative b, which is 6 plus minus square root b square negative 6 square minus 4 times a times c divided by 2a. So we get 6 plus minus square root of 36 minus 4, 32 divided by 2. So equals 6 plus minus, this one can be simplified to 4 square root of 2 divided by 2. So finally we get 3 plus minus 2 square root of 2. For the second one, again, plug in. So we get 2 times t, which is x squared plus 1 plus 3x equals 0. Expand it and correct my turn. So we get 2x squared plus 3x plus 2 equals 0. Because the discriminant delta equals b squared, 3 squared minus 4, a is 2, c is 2, 9 minus 16, negative 7, less than 0. No real solution for this one. So the only real solutions for the given equation are these two. If you like this video, please subscribe. Thank you.